Police continue to investigate the disappearance of Bremen Campbell Jr. The last week and two days have been an emotional whirlwind for his family. Today, they conducted a search party of their own, desperate to get answers on where he could be. Not even some rain could stop loved ones of Bremen Campbell Jr. from spending most of their Saturday searching for him in Gary. For us not to know where he is, um, text messages never go unanswered, phone calls never go unanswered. So um, I'm just praying um, that he makes it home safely. So it's like I'm a little looking for my own son. Bremen was last heard from on July 27th. His dad unsure where or why he left home. His license, uh, his wallet, keys, and uh, his phone was on the uh, table. It's a mystery. Nothing like this is, has never, ever happened before. Family near and far came together to retrace his last known steps. And if I could give you this flyer, and we want to thank you for looking out for us. Starting at his house off of Merle Lane, they then went knocking door to door, asking neighbors if anyone had seen him. Actually, a lot of people in this community know him, so there are, a lot of people are shocked, like, oh, wow, he was just here, or I just talked to him. So everybody's kind of coming together and searching for him. They passed out flyers and hung them up, too. Their search to find him extended beyond the residential streets. We went to Miller Beach. That's on the lakefront. Uh, we went over there, Broadway Street, north and south. Uh, Grant Street. The Gary police have been in abandoned buildings, though, and like dumpsters. Bremen's children are worried sick for his safety. I'm still in a dreamland, so I don't, I don't think it's settled. I love everything about him. He taught me a lot about life, and I just, it just don't seem like real. Bremen has been missing for over a week now. Family and friends are determined to bring him home, no matter the circumstances. We're a praying family. And we have a lot of prayers going up, and we're just, just believe and have faith. Anyone with information on his whereabouts is asked to call Gary Police. We're live in Gary, Andrea Medina, WGN News.